Hey guys, Rick is here and today we're gonna try one of the Marvel's effects. Have you ever heard about Wanda, Scarlet Witch? So today we're gonna recreate this together. And by the way, at the end of this video, I'm gonna share with you the information where you can find the footages to use in this kind of video for free. I need to shoot the proper footage for this animation. Then open a dub after effect, create composition and put in the video. I need to find the place for the animation. Then click right mouse button, new, now object. Click right mouse button on the video, find track and stabilize, track motion. It will be the tracker. You need to find a place of your animation and drag the first tracker point there. Press play and you get points for all your frames. In my case it didn't work, so I need to set it manually, frame by frame. It happened because I didn't have an object to pin the point to, just empty background. Once you finish the tracking, you need to press edit target, make sure that your now object is here, then press ok. Next step is choosing the animation. I'll choose an energy ball. Drag it to the list and then on the video. Press right mouse button, blending mode, screen to remove black background on your animation. Go to transform, change it to proper size and move and position on of your tracker. Go to whip and pull it to now object. Therefore, we pin animation of to tracker. Highlight the animation with now object, click right mouse button, pre-compose, OK. It will be much easier to use our effect in this way. Again click on animation and change it to screen. To change color, highlight pre-compose, go to effect, color correction, curves. Here I'll adjust brightness and contrast by eye. Then I need to change the color itself. Again, effect, cover correction, and tint. Choose the cover you need. I want to add brightness, and for this, I'll add one more curves effect. You decide. Next step is go to effects, stylize, glow. Here you can change the radius and intensity. Make sure you change glow operation source from add to screen. You can duplicate glow and play with parameters, but here don't change <laughs> the source from add to screen. To make the energy ball more realistic, we need to blur the hand. I found this trick on internet, so decided to share with you. Create adjustment layer, let's name it blur, move it below effect layer. Then go to effect, blur and sharpen, compound blur. As you can see, the entire picture has changed, but I need only my hand. To fix it, simply change blur layer to effect layer. You can see that picture back to initial, but hand is blurred. Change the intensity on your mind. So the effect depends on your footages, so you can try any of them to get desired results. Under the video, you'll find the link where you can find these footages and download it for free to use in your project. Subscribe my channel, put your like, leave your comment, you're always welcome there. And see you later, bye bye.